Jess Clamar YouTube channel. So welcome to the door of my room. Um, I, I think I'll switch in a second to my wide angle lens on my wide wide angle camera. You know what I mean? There we go. Um, apologies if the footage is a little bit sort of washed over when you do turn to the uh, wide angle lens. It does uh, remove a bit of that colour filter in a little bit. However, this is the new look of my room. See the view out of my window, and I am recording over the footage so you can see that my bed's oriented so the headboard to the wall. Although we haven't been sleeping like that, I have my posters on the wall behind where my TV is. Um, luckily, the TV is on a uh, wall mount, which means I can swizzle it around however I want. Uh, moving over to probably this side of my room, you can see my Nintendo Switch is at the back there, plugged into my TV so I can play it whenever I like. Um, and I've recently moved my fan onto the top of these cubes just because um, it was originally in my wardrobe but I'm running out of room in there and um, you can see all of my deodorants and my aftershaves on the left hand side and the candles, I'm a big candle fiend as I like to call myself um, on the right hand side uh, along with these obviously I've got some links and um, we do have uh, all of my aftershave as well so I've got um, one from my Step one. I've got Avon's Mesmerize Red, I've also got Hugo Boss and some uh, Playboy one, which I mean I like all of them and I thought I'd turn the lights on just to give you a bit of a better view. Um, we have this light up sort of picture slash ornament sort of thing um, that really really lights up really well and I like it very much. Um, I'm just moving something out of the way so I can get to where I need to be. Obviously these cubes are house all of my favourite shoes. I have the Adidas White and Blue there. I'm not entirely sure the name of those. <coughs> On the right hand side I have my yellow Pharrell Williams. And actually behind the cubes is a signed syndicate poster for when I met him at, I want to say, I-64 or I-65. At Insomnia, that was pretty cool. Um, we have this teddy bear as well, I think I'll show you in a minute. Um, but going lower down we have my uh, Burgundy NMDs, my white Swifts, and then side we have these red or dark red um, Doc Martens which I've always wanted a pair of Doc Martens they usually don't suit me but I really really like these ones and these actually fit me quite well and suit me quite well uh, so I've got my um, red I've got the gold I think they've got Durups and then my limited edition added out in the bottom right which I got from America moving into my wardrobe you can see my two uh, piles of washing and then just a normal side note bag that's got my laptop in it but we have all of my old cool clothes. I don't usually wear many of these other than probably this coat, which is my new uh, super dry coat, and then this uh, red burgundy uh, Adidas jacket. I then try and squeeze everything up in my wardrobe just to make a bit of room to show you guys. Uh, when you're living with a girl, they leave their stuff everywhere, and that's two four bags of her stuff that she needs to take home. In my top drawer on my left hand side, we have my t shirts. I've recently got rid of uh, quite a few t-shirts to make room. We have my uniform and we have uh, some socks and underwear, you know, just a regular men sort of shit that you have in the top drawer. Uh, these are my favourite socks at the minute though. Once I've sort of showed you, I have to try and like um, undo it with my teeth. But we have Pringle socks. <laughs> Bought these from Primark the other day. Three pack for I think it's like three quid. You get a packet, uh, a packet of, you get a set of salt and vinegar original and cheese and onion, it's not cheese, it's sour cream and whatever it is, I don't, I don't eat them ones anyway, and like I said, just my underwear. Uh, moving down a row, I've actually got a load of washing in, so I'm missing quite a few, but on the left hand side I keep all of my sort of track suits, this one here, this black one, is my black uh, XIX Sidemen track suit, I brought both the joggers and the top to go with it, and then on the right hand side is all my jumpers, you know I've got my Sidemen jumper there, my mindset switch jumper there, I'm quite impressed with that one, that's one of my favourites, and this Adidas one that I found again recently, so that's pretty cool there with my second drawdown. In the third drawdown, or third sort of shelf down should I say, we have all of my jeans that I wear for work, and then some shorts on the right hand side, we have, we have I've got a couple of pounds at the back of that shelf that I keep shit in. On the bottom shelf, which is my least gone to, is all my sports gear, and some old jumpers. And then down 
the side of the wardrobe, I keep my dressing gown, Becky's sort of dressing gown throw thing, and then just some random shitty bits that I can fit down the side. Over here we have my brand new basketball hoop, whoop, whoop. This was one of my secret Santa presents that I've just managed to hook up. Um, I had to move that. And then in a second you'll see me sort of have to bend down and try and pick up the ball, which was quite the task of trying to keep the camera steady and picking up the ball. Featuring my pens. And um, we'll get the ball. And I make some sick, sick tonks here. Ready? Whoop. 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 Oh, fold it. Absolutely fold it. Anyway, keeping with the theme of being on this side of the bedroom. Um, these are my new bed sheets. I've recently got a new mattress as well to go with them. So, you know, like it's, it's practically a brand new whole bed setup. But over this side of the bedroom, I just wanted to lift my covers and show you that we have uh, all my board games and new board games all in a bag or in boxes down the side of the bed, including this one, which I may feature on the channel in a week or two's time. It's called Make an Impression. You have to read out famous quotes as well as say them in an accent to gain points. And then on the right hand side, just my plugs and everything I keep down the side of my bed. Um, Becky's iPad and Amazon Kindle on the right. And then the view out of my bedroom window is not the best view in the world, but you know, not many houses have views like this, so I, I, I quite like it. It's nice to wake up, especially in the summer or the winter when everything's uh, snowed over. And I have two of my candle sets on the window. Like I said, I really like my candles and I like these regularly. Um, but we'll revisit the left hand side of the window so at the end of the video. But I thought it'd be nice to just show you this half of my bedroom. This is the, uh, the sort of, I say bench or sort of seat that I made myself out of like a TV stand and just some uh, uh, filling that I made myself. And now it comes along to the cubes at the end of my bed. Uh, in this top right hand box we have all of my sort of um, I get blankets and sort of you know throws that I can put over the bed or if people are staying and need it and it's a bit cold. In this bottom one, I'm actually not going to show you because it's got all my important sort of banking and pay slips and just very important documents I like to keep hold of. Um, this is what I call Becky's Cube. This is where all of her shit goes, including Chris packets regularly and shoes whenever she stopped around. But she's gone to work now. This one is my favourite because it houses everything that I don't know where to put, i.e. bits of food. Um, this book specifically quite a few of my old Christmas presents, 50 do things to do while you poo, which features facts and games and just little things, all to do with while you poo, which I think is quite funny, I flipped to a page in a second and printed to a fact, there we go, a little maze on the right, 70% water, 10% indigest indigestible food, 10% dead bacteria, and 10% fat salts, live bacteria, dead cells and mucus is what makes up your shit, what are the other things about that? How cool is that for a secret Santa present? It, it is a book made by Hugh Jasman. Wait, no. Something like that. And then on the left hand side, we've got all my games and sort of like PlayStation games. I've got a lot of PlayStation games on the right hand side. My side men book on the left. And just a few different things on the left hand side as well as some sellotape. And then me other two drawers are just full of, uh, boxes are just full of shit, so I didn't particularly want to show it to me. Moving back around to the sort of left hand side of the front side of my bedroom. We have Becky's drawers, which is why I give them a big thumbs down, they're full of Becky's shit. Yeah. But we give a big thumbs up to Flat Eric over there. I'll give you a quick wave, hello. And this is my mini fridge, currently housing one, two, three bottles of Pepsi, and then fourth outside, because I can't fit it in. We have a uh, Gillian and Quality Street, lots of chocolate from Christmas and sweets. We have one, two, three, four packets have large mortar share galaxies as well as some snowy fingers uh, as you can see i like chocolate i didn't actually get that much that many sweets for christmas but this is becky's bottle of yogurt and mint that she stole from our local takeaway because we're best friends with them big up billy from being and kebabs uh, and then two packets of gillian as people know they're my favorite chocolates um up here we have a can of um i think it's strawberry and lime it's a strawberry and lime yeah, strawberry and lime at real relic. Um, cider. I don't drink it, it's Becky's, and she gets some from the pub when 
be when the regulars buy your drinks. And then up here in this packet is uh, chocolate truffles. A um, bit of an odd packaging, and to be fair, they're not the nicest of chocolates I've ever eaten in my life, but they are quite nice. On top of my fridge, this is what houses like my tacky, tacky crab. I've got, you know, a box full of crab and just little bits of my golf club there that I haven't opened yet. And these LED lights from uh, the Harry Potter themed, I need to send them up. I also have a, uh, well, what's meant to be a football slash bike pump and two pairs of my gloves. Uh, we also have this uh, hand sanitizer. don't know why I showed you this. We have a pot of Nivea cream for when I've got a bit of dry skin or a bit of eczema. At the side of the fridge we have this glass bauble and this light up glass bauble that is featured on the channel once or twice. Oh, I really like it, especially when I want to make my room light up quite nicely with different colours. Um, as well as Flat Eric. We all love Flat Eric, don't we? He packed us in form name or we can't go wrong. And then the second bottle of Pepsi, or fourth bottle of Pepsi, should I say. Now this is an LED light that Becky bought me on just before we come to it. And these two bags house a Nintendo Wii and a the old PlayStation 4 that was at Becky's before she started moving her room around and I brought it back to mine for a bit. But this light, uh, this LED uh, wire is really, really cool. Um, before I move on to all my computer setup, I thought I'd uh, show you my chair. And this chair is a GT player. Um, as you can see, it's set up like a GT Racer or anything like those, and GTX Omega, all of them sort of chairs. Comes with an adjustable back strap. Uh, it's actually really comfy, I really enjoy sitting in this, uh, as, as well as like a head cushion, but it makes a really nice sound when I want to tap on it. Give it a listen. Not that that's particularly loud. Anyway, <coughs> I've had to cut a bit out here just because of how, uh, what I showed you on the computer. But these uh, left and right screens are 1080p, Samsung screens are exactly the same, with a, a 4K monitor in the middle. If you guys have been a fan of the channel for a while, you'll know this. I have two ring LED lights that feature on the left and right hand side of my uh, setup. Uh, ready for when I have my green screen up, because it, I, you really need light, and when you have a green screen, that's the first thing that you need to know. My new keyboard with the best clicky sounds I've ever heard on a keyboard. I, I must admit, I am thoroughly loving this keyboard, and if you want to hear more keyboard typing sound videos, let me know down below and a very, very clicky mouse as well. We have a very dusty Alexa at the back. Um, I use this regularly, but I never tend to really pull it out far enough and I haven't given it a clean in a while. Um, my new Samsung Tab A 10.1 inch tablet and my Toby eye tracking system, which I'm thoroughly enjoying using. But this tablet, again, is another thing that I've been very impressed with. <coughs> I've sat and started watching The Witcher last night, which is pretty cool. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Uh, now, moving on to what do we move? We see my gin class. This is, I, I house a lot of these types of classes. I like them a lot, just to fill them up with Pepsi. Uh, on the right hand side of my desk, we have my Sony PlayStation 4 Pro that runs games in 4K very well indeed. And to record the audio, which is what I'm using now, we have the Blue Yeti. Uh, I think it's got the vintage one because it comes in white and sort of this nice coppery gold colour. I've just scratched on top of the mic for you guys. These headphones, I was debating getting some more headphones uh, over the past month or two. But I, I probably won't now, to be fair. I was really trying to figure out how I got these on. And it wasn't until the end that I realised that I had to go underneath. Yeah, but these are my Sony. They only cost me like 12 quid, but they work an absolute treat when I'm trying to record audio. Because it's just a 3.5 headphone, uh, 3.5 millimetre headphone jack that plugs into the uh, Blue Yeti. Now, talking a little bit about my PC, uh, you guys all know that I've had this PC for well over a year and a bit now. Uh, it's an i7-7700K, 16GB RAM GTX 1060 with a Samsung M.2 SSD, 6GB of storage, which is plenty, no, 6TB, sorry, 6TB of storage. Uh, and a, yeah, so this is my new candle, it's a tropical fruits sort of candle, it smells a lot of oh, exotic fruits. And obviously chewing gum. I'm chewing on right now. We have on the uh, end of the windowsill that we didn't show you my Call of Duty player that holds up my controllers, 
my sunset orange controller, my white controller, obviously you saw my black controller on the left hand side of my desk, and last but not least is my um, El Canso green screen. Anyway, on my cubes you can see the two pairs of headphones, a very old pair of something headphones and my sanizers, but that will be it for today, I hope you guys have enjoyed, see you later.